Welcome back mm -hmm. to Sunrise. We still have Adekunle Gold in the studio. Um, beautiful work you do, but okay. let's look at management yeah. of our talents, our talents, their careers, and we hear a lot of breakups, a lot of separations, and then everyone that leaves one just, just goes to start his own. At the end of the day, I'm sure we'll have a lot of... <laughs> so what's going on? I mean, yeah, um, you do know that um, record deals and then management deals uh, contracts and then every contract is going to end, you know. So um, if you're signed for two years, if the labor wants you to renew, they'll renew. If they don't want you to renew, you have to move on, you know. What is next to do is do your, put your team together and then start doing things by yourself. If nobody comes to sign you again, I mean, that's only fair. So I feel that right now, me, um, my contract expired with YBNL since 2017 and then I've been running my only two um, label called um, Afro-Urban Records and I have like the smallest team but it feels like we're an empire because we're doing great stuff, you know. So um, I don't think um, it's bad to move on to starting your own stuff if your contract ends. Okay, but does that mean that your, that, let's use you for instance and that you could, let's just say YBNL comes back and say, okay, we want you to renew. Would you now infuse yours under WebM? Definitely, yeah. People sign their labels to bigger labels, you know. So, or you sign your label to a label that will give you something more. So, definitely, I mean, it works. Hmm. Yeah. Let's look at your personal life. Yeah. What's it like when are you getting married? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You sang about. Yeah, anyway, she gives me. <laughs> <laughs> what like, what she gives me? <laughs> <laughs> La Rondo. But there's a rente. A rente is waiting in the wing somewhere. Uh, well, yeah, I mean. I don't know, I don't know when. Maybe soon, maybe maybe next year, maybe next year, yes. But you and Orente are good. Oh, good, we're good. Everything. Orente doesn't complain. <laughs> now, what year did you release Orente? Um, 2015, yeah. Good, so if you sang about her in 2015, and this is 18, and you're still good, well, what are you waiting for? Well, Pop the word. Maybe you can. <laughs> I don't know yet. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's one, that's story. That's one, that's one. Another story. <laughs> Maybe Orente is watching. Yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> how how your, are your parents blushing. taking your career? Um, they're happy now, before they were indifferent. Not like they didn't support me, but they were just indifferent. I mean, it didn't mean anything to them, but... What did your mother say? Your mothers and their sons? Uh, uh, my, mom, my mom used to think I used to waste money because she didn't understand. Mm -hmm. She didn't understand what I was doing. I would just go and, le and go to the studio make music mm -hmm. uh, at night. Pay studio up. time. Yeah, and then, because mm -hmm. I used to, I used to do freelancing for people. I would design logos and then whatever money they give me, I'll go to the studio with it and she'd be wondering, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. You're not saving, you don't have savings. And like, don't worry, it will make sense. Are you an only child? And, no, I'm the only son. Okay. Oh, yeah, dear. I have three sisters. Uh, 